Hello guys and welcome back to another Tammy video. This is going to be the build on my Gloucester Meteor F3 and we're going to get straight into the build uh, with this sprue. So this is the only sprue we need for uh, today's video and I uh, did a review on this so go and watch that and yeah this is the only sprue we need we're going to be putting the fuselages together basically so let's get started i'm just cutting these pieces out I'm going to try and make these videos not too long, so they don't get kind of boring, but, um, yeah. And as well, this is my first Tamiya kit, if you don't know, so, well, it's my first anything kit, uh, but other than air kits, because I haven't built anything, uh, apart from air kits yet, so this is my first thing. So, seems like a pretty nice fit. So, those I'm presuming go on there somehow. We should have a look at the instructions. Okay, so they go there. We need to sand them a bit first. So let's just do some bit of sanding. There we go. Okay, so let's get some tummy extra thin. So there we go, it's the second one. So now I've got these done, now it's time to put the actual fuselage together. So sometimes you do need something other than um, tan your extra thin when you are uh, gluing two fuselage halves together because it dries uh, too quick so once you've gone all the way around um, it it, uh, it is already dry so Go. So the top half. Oh, I mean. So 
um, it's not quite in line. some pegs on the tail Okay guys, I will get back to you where once I've uh, leave this to dry and uh, put some rubber bands around it, left it to dry and uh, yeah, I'll get back to you then. Okay guys, so I've left it to dry uh, for a bit and it's turned out pretty well. So the next step is the wings that are being put in on the bottom and the weight that's going in which is here it's actually quite heavy so first we're just going to sand some of these seams down and then we'll get started on that So now, let's put the bottom of the wings on, hopefully, uh, and back, no, we'll put the holes on, all the things on, stabs, and then we'll call it for this video, um, and then we can put the wings on in the next video, so, yeah. I'll have to leave it to dry for a bit, so it'll be best if I leave it to the next bit. The Tamiya Extra Thin again because uh, it's the best glue in my opinion. And there we go, there's one. And the next one. So there you go guys, that's all I've done for the first video, um, this is a pretty easy kit for uh, 148 but um, it is my first 148 kit so I guess that is uh, a good thing, but there is uh, quite nice engines in this actually, quite nice engines here. Here are the actual ones. So I might, I'll do a separate video on those when I come around to building them because 
uh, I want them to make, I want them uh, to look really good. So hopefully I can do that. So thanks for watching this video guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed it. This uh, I am starting to do a lot more building in these videos now, especially with this kit. Um, I do enjoy uh, building on camera. Actually, I wish I'd have done it sitting there instead of doing updates. But yeah, I was kind of uh, didn't really want to do it on camera just in case I messed up. But yeah, oh well. <laughs> of course, if you do mess up, you do. If you don't upload it, I guess, or you do. Or, yeah. So thanks for watching. That's it so far. And look out for the next video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.